Hey love bugs, it's Roslyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for the love and support. You're being gentle with yourself as well as being patient, seeing the signs and the synchronicities are constantly coming your way and, you know, adding them to your peaceful life journey. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. If you are comfortable enough, uh, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up telling me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if you uh, feel like the video is being very informative to you or just gave you some good vibes you would love to share with a loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow empath that are going through some dark times right now and need confirmation and validations toward their life purpose, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. And thank you once again for the love and support. It is so greatly appreciated. And I hope you're able to um, resonate with the content of my video. Y'all got stuck. I had an emotional moment right before I started doing my video. I just got to chill and I saw my dad and all of a sudden I just started crying. It was like beautiful, beautiful tears though. You know, when you get emotional and you, I guess it's because I'm releasing a lot. Um, but anyways, um, I had to tell y'all that just in case you see my face kind of red or my eyes watering up a little bit. Um, uh, video that I'm doing today is uh the devil tries to forge a weapon uh on you that will not won't pro prosper you know you know how they always say we weapons formed against us won't prosper and it's not you know we're we're going we're winding down a emotional challenging shift a cycle and you're probably getting this urge like you know things are shifting for you but it's like right now you are feeling a love of emotions because I can feel it right now because I'm getting it, you know, but it, it's like a beautiful feeling because you have been, you, you've been fighting a battle for far too long. You have been, and you know, you're being patient, even though times get hard, you know, that, you know, devil, darkness, negativity wants to weigh you down, make you feel like you're at a low frequency, put you, keep you in a low frequency. But there's been signs and synchronicities that, you know, give you little hints that, you know, just keep on going, you know, be patient. Um, you know, blessings are right around the corner and they are, you know, it might be right around the corner like the next street or it might be right, right around the corner in the next city, you know, but it's right around the corner. You know, you get signs every day. You're probably getting, seeing different numbers that, you know, uh, is bringing forth towards things to let you know. I, I like me, I'm a numbers girl. Anytime I see the double numbers, they're mir mirroring each other. I always look them up. I always say angel number like eight eight nine, or seven eight seven, or eight seven eight. You know, different things like that. This going on, and you know, you really should read up on it. If there's angels coming towards you and they they want to congratulate you, or they're giving you a pat on the back. You know, they're just letting you know things are getting better because we're highly protected and I know there's times where you can get stressed out be confused you know bamboozled you know feeling stagnant at certain times and some things might be winding down or slowing or even probably stopping but there you're going towards that next level and you know you've been going for it for so 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 long and it's just like the heavens are proud of you for doing the things that you've been doing um being able to you know embrace your gift you know, educating yourself more about the things that you're, you, you know, about your life purpose. Why are you here? You know, what are you supposed to be contributing to? You know, am I loving myself enough? Am I loving others enough? Am I reaching out towards others enough? And, you know, these, these different things are coming up in your head. I see a lot of visions of y'all doing that. And it's just like, I can feel y'all like, ugh, like y'all been running the race. And it's just like, you're about to hand that baton off the next person. So you can just keep going, keep going. And it's just like, they're proud of you for doing all these things. And they wanted you to know this. And it's just like, even though darkness tries to weigh you down, you know, things, monkey wrenches get thrown in your, 
you in your program all the time. You know, if, if it's not somebody coming at you crazy or things are just not happening the way you, you thought they were going to happen for you. Um, that doesn't mean it's not going to happen. It just might not be happening right now. But they are coming towards your way. It is coming towards your way. You know, heaven's universe is working hard to make sure anything that you're aiming towards, you can, like I tell y'all before, you can pray on one thing and things will be magnified to you can't even fathom the blessings that are coming into your life. Because you can be praying for one thing and it's like a gazillion things keep coming in to where blessings going to keep coming left and right for you. You're like, wait a minute, hold up. I can't deal. Wait a minute. You know, and it's going to get overwhelming with you because all these blessings are about to come into your life you know everybody's connecting in so many different ways uh, being in situations where you know you're probably getting flu-like symptoms it is because your body is clearing out detoxing all these the dark energy everything you've been holding on yourself it, it's like you're breaking the emotional chains to your life you know you're you're wiping out this cycle you know and I told y'all with us clearing out these karmatic cycles karmatic curses and Generate, generational uh, no generational curses and karmatic cycles it is going to put you through some hell type situations like i can't deal i don't want to deal with this anymore don't give up on yourself that's what darkness wants you to do you need to keep moving don't allow yourself to lose focus on worrying about what other people are doing around you you know people might come at you crazy or you know just just being ignorant you just send them send them love and blessings and you keep moving you need to put like those little things them horses got on, you know, when they're when they're walking in the parade and, you know, they, they put those shields on them. You have to put those spiritual shields on yourself so, you know, you don't lose focus on what you're trying to aim towards. I mean, I have different stuff that goes on with me every day, every, every day. And there's times I, I sit here and cry, you know, I'm like, I'm doing everything I'm asked. Why do I have all this coming at me you know why am I dealing with all this so much you know it's just beginning to the point where it is hard to bear but you can handle that that's the strength you have in yourself you are gonna have that urge to fight you know you might want to give up at that moment but there's something that's telling you get back up get back up you might you know but if you need to rest rest that's fine but don't lose focus on what you're trying to aim towards don't give up on something that because it seems too hard that's, I mean, when, when you know, when you've been working your butt off, and it's just like I tell my children, when you know you, if, if you're needing support and people don't support you, that's fine. That is fine. You know, because when you get everything that you need to get, is nobody can sit up here and say that you, you wouldn't have what you had if it weren't for them. You know, because it's just like when you get those situations and you're coming up on blessings, you worked hard. These are something that you earn. Like, universe says it's just rewards repaid in kind Car karma is coming towards you in the best ways and you know what anything else is coming towards people and they're being ugly towards you trust me they're getting their karma too <laughs> and they're getting their karma too you know and just don't allow yourself to lose focus keep quiet when you need to keep quiet you know don't let the left hand know what the right hand's doing you know just keep doing you you pray on the things you need to pray on let go of the things you need to let go of don't control the you know don't control anything except how you respond to things and how you intake it as well so you need to just constantly keep going because it's just like right now you know like I was looking at my post that I put on one of my um on one of my videos a few weeks ago it was probably about a month ago and it's like you know the devil's working hard because he see what God got for you the universe he sees what the universe got for you and he's like oh hell no they got this and this and that coming oh no no let me throw this in there let me throw that oh let me bring a side of drama or let me bring some side of fights or let me have her to where she want him or her to ready to cuss out somebody or choke out somebody all these things are coming your way so you got to stay woke pay attention to things around you but don't lose focus on what you're trying to aim for you keep doing it you know, if you need to rest, take that rest. Take that break that you deserve. It's okay, but don't don't stop moving. Don't stop moving. You know, if you need to grieve off of a situation that, you know, you're parting ways with, grieve on it, but don't stay there. Don't unpack your stuff. Don't unpack your stuff. Just, you know, just sit there for a minute, cry, boo-hoo, say your kumbaya-yas, and, you know, do what you need to do. But you have this light within yourself that you need to really see. You know, people will contradict you. You will, people you know, might see you inferior or they try to play that inferior role with you or they might see the light before you do. So, of course, they're going to bring stuff towards you that way. I have it happen to me all the time. But, you know, I keep going. I keep doing what I need to do.
I'm not going to allow things like that to stop me. It might upset me for a minute, but for a quick second. And then I dry them tears up and keep it moving because I don't have time. And, you know, put my energy on focus on things that are contributing towards my life. Not, you know, bringing me at a lower level. Those are the energies you need to put base on. So you keep doing you. Loving yourself, loving others around you, whether or not they're sending that love back to you or not. Because you're going to get that love back regardless. You know, if somebody kill them with kindness or kill them with silence, you you know, people wait for you to have a response. Sometimes being silenced is that response. So you keep growing, you keep learning, invest in yourself, invest in things that is going to prosper, you know, for you and bring you growth, wisdom, knowledge, care, love, anything that's positive, face your energies, place your energies on stuff like that. So I hope you were able to resonate with the content of this video. Much love to y'all. I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. Um, I'm giving a post notification shout out to Mimi. What's up, love? I missed you. I'm glad you uh, texted me the other day. Well, I mean, dropped me a comment. Uh, Gabriel from Raising Soul, much love to you. And I hope you've been enjoying yourself. And Hey Oka Rumor, much love to you as well. So like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Drop me a line. I would love a chance to hear from you. And I can be able to give you a, a, a post notification shout out. You know, hit the bell share give me a thumbs up and i'll see you on my next video much love peace be wild